Good people of YouTube, my name is Spanner and welcome back for some more Terraria, it's episode 2. And I'm in a new house. Done a bit of work, changed this a bit, um, I moved the rooms, the NPC rooms to upstairs because Daniel here seemed very insistent on leaving the house and leaving the door open at night and then zombies come in and zombies deal a lot of damage. So I moved the rooms in, I checked on the wiki, the rooms need to be uh, the interior uh, width has to be 7 blocks and the height 5. Need a chair, a table and a light source and a door. And the back wall. So yeah, I still have to finish these two rooms up here, but this one is Daniel's room for now and we have another one if another NPC would like to come in. Have a little furnace here, we can make some extra stuff. I can smelt some ores, but I don't need to yet. Crafted some boreal wood armor. One defense each. And get a uh, one defense bonus from the whole set. I think I can craft some potions. No, maybe I need something... Something else for the potions. Maybe some special apparatus. But for now, oh, got some shuriken. Also made myself a bow. Oh, I, I think I made my, I made the bow last episode. I made myself some arrows, four hundred of them. And I have a spelunker push potion from somewhere, so that might come in handy. And I opened the herb bag, got the water leaf, moon glow, water leaf, and blink root, blink root seeds. So, oh, it's getting night again. I think I took too long for the intro. So I think we will... Oh yeah, this sword's a lot better. I think I'll plant a bunch more acorns. And maybe we'll make a mining pit. Oh, I can't plant them. Needs to be on grass, perhaps. Plant a bunch here. That's probably good enough for now. One here. So, I had one all grown here. Do these grow more if I leave them? I don't know. And do I get boreal wood if I plant them in the snow? Well, the sapling definitely looks different. Maybe. Let me just get some extra because I'm going to need to make some wood platforms. Oh, there's a big purple slime. Let's get out of here. Oh, another tree just grew. I can't aim, apparently. Okay. How do I want to do this? There's water there. Right place blocks. Shouldn't the water disappear? Odds. 
Let's see, I want some wood platform. I guess rope could do if I had more of it, but I don't. So let's dig down. This water might actually be useful. Break my fall, perhaps, although it's not a lot of it. Hope there's anything interesting down here, like perhaps a cave. That might be interesting. Is that some ore? Probably just stone. Yeah, just stone. Is the wooden pick better than the copper one, maybe? Maybe a boreal wood pick? Can I even make wooden picks? I don't remember seeing one when I tried crafting. When I was crafting the swords. Just some stone. Nothing interesting so far, unfortunately. And another thing, if I have copper weapons and tools, is there still copper ore? Seems a bit counterintuitive that I start with copper stuff and then can mine more copper. Maybe for armor, but... If wood is better than copper, then I don't see the point since I already have some wooden armor. So far, this is a big pile of nothing. Let's get rid of the smart cursor. Since I keep hitting the walls. Oh, am I? I think we're getting into a cave. Nice. Unleash the water. Cool. Okay, we'll stop here for now. Uh, and let's do some explore exploration. A worm. There are two pots here. Some silver and lesser healing potions. A bunch of water down here. This water is very, very light blue color, which is very interesting because it was dark blue just a moment ago. It's a lighting thing, I presume. And I'm chilled. Oh, it's probably because I'm under the snow biome? Well, there is a bunch of water here. I don't think I can get back up if I go down there. So this side there's a whole lot of nothing and nothing going on. Okay, 
blue slime destroyed. More nothing. Really? There are two pots here. Some glow sticks. And some torches. I guess I could use some glow sticks too. I have a bunch of them. Make a rave party over here. Anything upstairs? There's a cave to the right. Other than that, more nothing. Some some shiny or shiny ore over there um, and the pots. Some more glow sticks. If I remember correctly, glow sticks work underwater. What the hell is that? More shinies, I think. Unless it's the lighting playing tricks on me. What's this? Stone block. Tungsten. The hell is tungsten? And why do I need it? Let me get this. I think this is. Oh, this is tin. Okay. And all the tungsten. There's another cave down here. Let's breathe. This will drain a lot of the water down there. Oh, that's a nice effect. Oh, hi zombie, how the hell did you get here? Ow! Zombies deal with a lot of damage. I'm dead. There's stuff to explore there, but the zombie got in there somehow. And we were a bit stuck. Think I heard? Yes, I did. Oh, how do I get up there? I guess I could open this. Yay, fallen star. Here's my regular woods. Okay, go down. I did not think this through, did I? I was going to place the platforms when I got up. Guess this kind of works. Zombie has a raincoat and way more health than the other ones.
Probably not the best use of platforms. Do I even have enough? Not if I keep wasting them. Okay, I'm going to repurpose some of these platforms and I'll be right back. Okay, redid the platforms a little bit. And still got some left over. Okay, let's make our way to our death point. Wasn't there a glow stick on there? There we go. Uh, maybe I should get that ore. I think it's ore. Hope it's not just the stone playing tricks on me with the lighting. That's tin. I don't know what tin is used for, so I guess I'll gather all of it. Hello, Umbrella Slime. Don't know how you got yourself in here, but... You've made your last mistake. Oh, I dropped his umbrella. Can I pick it up? Did I pick up an umbrella? I did not. Hello, is this more tin? More tin. I won't complain about it, but I would rather have some iron, I think. That's all of it. Oh, there's a pot. With some rope, nice. How do I craft rope? Seems useful. Oh, there's some cobwebs. And slime. And what appears to be more tungsten. will come in handy. Thinking about using the, um, the cobweb instead of the platforms. Well, I'll have... Currently my pit is a three block wide, so... My character is two blocks wide, I think. So I can fall down one side and have cobweb to um, to catch me down there, and I can use the platforms to go back. I saw a pot. I like this moving water though. Looks nice. When I play this, it uh, well, it was all like blocks flow, uh, falling down. What's this? Uh, what's that? What's this sands. Place torch. There we go. What's that sands. Hardened sand block. Okay, I'm not going to dig that up. The sand will fall on top of me. But there is pots down here. I think I broke it and got a torch, right? Oh, there's 
appears to be some more shinies there. And here too. Oh, and is that, uh, is that iron? Maybe. Oh, damn right it is. And clay. Maybe with a siren I can get a better pickaxe. And there's a red slime up there. Luckily slimes float and they can't follow us down here. Oh, there's more. Oh. Okay, first let me make perhaps a platform here. Oh! Sandworm! Get over here, you bastards! Yeah, go back to Arrakis. Where you belong. Oh yeah, a bunch, bunch of iron. Very large, well, not very large. Medium-sized, perhaps. Iron vein. And I think there's more tin. Nice. Making some progress. bunch of this already. Well, it doesn't hurt to have more. Another one of you. Damn it, worm. go. Worm down. Is there loot here? Yeah, a bunch of them. A lot more tin. And what's this? Tungsten. Tungsten and tin. I hope this tin is useful. You know what I could go for right now? A chest with goodies. Well, maybe, maybe more than one. What's that thing? Take care of the slime. Die slam. And what is this? Barely nothing. Okay. Something weird down here too. It's this reddish block. Nothing apparently. See, iron and a bunch of tin. If I go back home and I can't even make tools out of tin. 
I'm not going to be happy. Not at all. Was there something in the water above me? Before we go further down? Maybe it's uh, this vein that I'm seeing. Oh, and since I'm in uh, softcore, I can do the cheaty way of going back up, which is just dying, but I'll try not to. But I can't make any promises. Wait, have I reached the stone level? Oh, you yeah, are going deep. Very deep. I don't think there's anything in this water, so let's go up. Oh, and nothing. Okay. Guess I could dig, but I don't really have a good direction to go. So I guess we'll leave it at that. Uh, Let's go back up. Let's see, I think there was another branch I could have explored. There's a slime here. Slime that deals a ton of damage. Okay. Not what I was hoping for. And I didn't really want to go back up yet. Oh, those trees are getting big. Let's go down again. And I guess I'll place my cobweb downstairs. Something like this. Oh, did I break it? Uh, let's put it on the ground. Like this. Let's test it. Maybe it doesn't work anymore. Here we go. Oh! <laughs> that uh, wasn't expected. Suddenly, Umbrella Slime. I don't remember inviting an Umbrella Slime. This Yellow Slime has a lot of health. Yeah, it seems to work, so I kind of break it, though. Let's see, do I have everything? Ooh, blue jellyfish. I can kill these for glow sticks. Uh, look at it tumble. Tumble away. Two glow sticks. Yeah, I guess this was it, I think. Oh, there's a... something here. This block right in front of me. Amethyst. That's what I wanted. I guess there wasn't really another branch. Let's get my money. Should probably store it in a chest. Okay, I guess this will do for this episode. So we've explored a bit, and now I have to go back up. 
which is a bit painful, but hope I can get um I think I could get a mirror. Was wasn't there a mirror that I could use to teleport back to my spawn point? Yeah, we gotta get ourselves one of those, but we gotta find some chests first. So yeah, thank you guys for watching episode number two. I hope you have enjoyed it and I'll see you all next time.